All right, what's going on everybody? It's Tristan and today in this video what I got going on for y'all as you guys can probably guess uh, by the title and all that I'm gonna be going over the best resale items and really uh, the ones you will be able to you know want to go for really just You know how you guys can know which ones you want to go for and uh, the ones you'll be able to make money off of basically the ones I'm gonna show you just kind of on this list. I got just it's a, it's an order You just you can follow them whatever once I mean this week's actually really good uh, In terms of like reselling items and just yeah, honestly just a lot of items yeah, I mean there's a decent amount of items like the collab so Supreme and Yohi Yamaru. I think I think that's how you pronounce it. Hopefully I said that correctly. But uh, yeah, that collab is pretty hyped, and there's a lot of items from that that are honestly pretty cool. But it, it's done decently well. You know, I'll be going over all that. I, I, I can give my opinion a little bit in it, but I'm mainly just going to discuss resale and all that because that's what you guys are here for. So enough intro. I hope you guys will enjoy. Uh, if you want more content like this, you know, drop us a subscribe below. Let's try and hit like 200 likes. That'd be dope. And uh, yeah, you know, I guess if you want to also, I said this as usual, but you guys can check the IGs down below. I'd appreciate the follow there. Um, mainly on the personal account, that'd be dope. And uh, yeah, you know, en enough discussion. Let's just get into the, you know, the items you'll want to go for. And uh, I'll give you guys just kind of the breakdown and which ones, resell, retail, all that. So let's go. All right, so as y'all can see, I'm right here with the screen recording. As I mean, I, I literally do this with most of my videos. I'm just here, kind of like presenting information. So again, shout out to the community, just kind of for the, like the pictures here. I mainly do this just so I don't have to like Photoshop pictures to put in the video. Just it saves me time to make videos since I'm in college now. Hopefully, it's understandable since you know I got a lot, I got a lot of school stuff and you know other stuff I'm doing. You know that's just that's how it is. But uh, I still want to focus on this as much as I can. So the first item, and I do agree with this. Um, and again, I'm not using their like order of items here. I'm just using it again for the pictures but i will say that this one is correct because this is again definitely the most hyped uh this collab is very hyped this week so the supreme yohi yamato logo t this one right here is definitely one you want to go for i think it's going to be retailing at like 48 dollars uh so this one you know it's, it's not too expensive of a retail and you know either colorway is really good to go for honestly i think resale i'll just i'll say it right off the bat just to save you guys a bit of time i'll probably say it's 90 to 120 dollars and honestly i think that's a pretty good uh estimation because this is hyped and uh you know even i mean people don't even know like I, I'm, I'm gonna be honest like bro I'll, I'll look up what Yohi Yamato is right now because like I need to educate myself a bit and you can guys can call me whatever you want because I don't know it but I'm not like copying this collab for resale because I don't know what it is you know what I mean but um yeah there's a lot of people that actually psych I'm probably gonna cop anyways what am I talking about okay so I, actually yeah okay okay I, I'm, I'm, I'm just being dumb I, I've known who this guy is so I've seen some of this stuff before um but yeah I did know that he was a Japanese fashion designer so I, I did I did know a little bit okay yeah Y3 okay so I do know who this is yeah this is the dude that made Y3 okay so Supreme and Y3 all right yeah so I, I know who this is all right this is cool um, yeah, you know, I mean, they could have just, you know, they could have said Y3 or whatever, but, you know, I guess educate myself a little bit more. Yeah, back to this, the resale of 90 to like 120, I think that's pretty accurate to say on this one. This is definitely the most typed item this week, and uh, one you can definitely, you know, go for. I mean, shoot, I'm going to go for it. You might as well, too. I mean, I said I wasn't going to go for it, but, like, let, let's, I'm just not going to cap. Like, this is money, so I'm going to go for it. But, yeah, this one, uh, Supreme Team, you know. On, uh, honestly, either colorway. If you want to know which one's more hyped, I'd probably say the white one, just because it's the like you know the logo stands out a little bit more. But I'm um, I'm not copping this like keep. You know what I mean? Because I don't I don't like know like I didn't even know like what, what Yohi Yamato is until like I looked it up. So you know I'm not I'm not copping. It. And the next most hyped item I was honestly I was gonna say the pipe wrench, but I'm I'm gonna be honest. I was like looking at all the listings and like all the stuff like this happened in this week, and I'm actually gonna say I think the next most hyped item is actually gonna be probably this crew neck right here. I think this is definitely gonna be one that people are looking for, and I'd say the most hyped colorway will probably be the black one right here. This colorway, uh, as you can see, I think this is just probably gonna retail right around probably 148, so not like. Two too expensive um well i mean it, that's a decently expensive for just like a crew neck but um yeah you know you can definitely make some money on this i definitely see these ones probably reselling around 200 dollars, and i definitely think it's like kind of like a sleeper one because i feel like this one will uh somehow some just like sell out somewhat decently fast but not like as fast as like i feel like it could but i feel like it's still gonna resell like you know when there's like sleeper items each week this is like that one from like the collab i feel like it's kind of kind of gonna be so i just kind of want to point that out as like the second one uh i just i'm kind of feeling that vibe from this one because you know it just it's get, get it's like the logo design again you know what i mean so it just if we're heading into winter time too people are going to want something like a crew neck it just it makes sense to me like maybe maybe you now see what i'm talking about since i brought up the winter theme so yeah uh fall winter people are gonna want a crew neck it'll probably resell like that so no doubt in my mind that people are gonna sleep on this one a little bit so i don't think it'll resell as fast as it can you still look out for it probably and the black colorway again definitely the one uh black or white colorway probably most hype but you can go for anyone really 
I'd just say the four screen one probably is not the best. And next up, yes, I was gonna say the Supreme Rigid Pipe Wrench, this one right here. Now, do I have any clue what a pipe wrench is gonna retail for? And obviously, there's a <laughs> there's a good reason um, why Supreme is making a pipe wrench. No, it is not for the like actual purpose. Like people, like Supreme like made a crowbar, not for the purpose of like what it's made for. Supreme made uh, like they've made a bunch of other items. They made like um a measuring cup that was not for that. That just and they made a scale that's not just for like weighing stuff like small stuff like the scales for what like you know what i mean like they've been making like like mischief like mischievous themes items for like a little bit and this is just kind of like another one i don't really know uh what this one would be used for like breaking into something or like breaking something but i know that's kind of what it would be associated with or you know maybe supreme should make it a pipe wrench shoot maybe i'm just like i'm i'm, I'm just you know judging because you know the pyrex cup and all that but you have to think about what the pyrex cup would be associated with if y'all kind of know that stuff supreme knew what they were doing with that so this one i have no clue what it will retail at i'd say it honestly probably somewhere in like the 40 50 dollar uh range because again it is it is it does look a little bit expensive but i mean i think probably in like the 30 50 dollar range 30 50 dollar range would be better but um yeah i think probably reselling this will probably be around like 70 to 100 dollars. i mean i really couldn't see it being that expensive like i don't know how expensive a pipe wrench is but like seriously how like how like how expensive are they like maybe maybe i'm un uneducated no nah, look they're like uh they're not they're not that expensive at all yeah like 9 12 no nah, okay so yeah there's no way this is gonna cost like that that much so i think resale probably like 70 to 100 dollars max on this one uh third most hyped i'd say this week second or third wherever you want to put it whatever order you want to put this video in if you feel free but that's just kind of where i see this item standing uh you know i looked at the price and all that and uh yeah these <laughs> they're not as expensive so i'm not uneducated i knew i knew i was right like there's no way this costs too much so hopefully supreme not you know won't overcharge y'all but we'll, we'll see you can cop this one for resale accessory people are going to want it even though it's random I promise you people will want it just to keep in the room as an accessory part of the collection you know or they'll be using it for the purpose of whatever mischievous I don't know, you know? And next up, I was definitely gonna put this one, uh, the Scribble Wolf Tee. This one is super fire. I just think it's something a little different. And, you know, shout out Yohi Yamato. This is like, this is super fire. So this one, I'm definitely gonna put probably at like, I think retail is probably gonna be $48 again. It's got the little mini BOGO on it, got the signature on it. It's like, it looks like a drawing, like on the tee. It's something a little different. And uh, I think it's actually really nice. Like, this is something like from like Supreme, I can actually like respect like as an item. Like I, I would low key like mess with this, but like, I, I don't know. Like I, I just, I'm not, I'm like, I'd rock some Supreme, but like I'm not too sure like you know this one I'm actually a big fan of so with the retail being probably around 48 bucks I think this one will probably resell and probably the 70 to 90 dollar range I mean it's a very nice design and I honestly think like probably the white color will be more hyped but to be honest either one will be good because like you can see the colors inverted on the drawing is inverted on like the black tee so it's like white and the black tee and then on the white tee it's black so you know what I mean like uh, the designs are very nice on both and I think resale is definitely gonna happen on this tee so don't sleep um, you can, I mean again I don't point out the likes and sub community because I don't think that really means anything but yeah again definitely go for this like this is something you can make money on so like if you want to make some money go for the scribble wolf tee and uh honestly this is probably one of my favorite items this week like in terms of design and all that it's definitely the best one in my opinion got the little bogo design signature you know it's well done and i actually appreciate it so uh yeah shout out supreme for the heat and next up i was definitely gonna put this one uh this sweater from supreme and again the collab this week this one kind of just has like a uh it's like i see at least from what i see right here in the picture i can't like zoom in on it but like it looks like it's kind of like an 8-bit theme like kind of like an old like uh vintage style kind of like flower and it's like on this tee right or not tee but crew neck right here um and, or a sweater if you want to call it that i guess that's what they're saying it is but um either way sweater crew neck uh this one is definitely one uh you could go for it's a little bit of a different design or i, I think the reason it looks like that is because it is a sweater and it's like embroidered of uh, like uh, onto the like you know what i mean yeah so i'm actually a big fan of this one and i you know i think it's a little unique you know just you see like the whole design and it, it this is something definitely something different um and i honestly think it's pretty uh, like well done like i'm a big fan of this one and honestly like i would i would cop this one like i'm actually like in, between this one and the wolf one i'd probably cop this one but again yeah i'm going back with my word a little bit but like this one is like really well done and honestly i think this one again probably gonna retail like 128 148 in that range and with that i think it will probably resell i think it will probably resell like around like 170 like 200 that's my honest like answer there uh you know i think people could sleep on this one a bit maybe it will resell maybe it won't but like i definitely think this is one i want to go for uh because like honestly this is a super clean design so shout out Prem. they did went they went hard and uh you know again retail not too expensive hopefully and this is you know just something a little different it, like it's not like with the logo or like theme and all that you know just it's 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 a different than the rest of the items like clearly and like it stands out and i like that 
That's why I'm putting it out as a resale item. And yes, these ones are also gonna resell uh, the Supreme and Yohi Yamato Y3, whatever you want, call it beanies. These ones are retailing definitely at 38 bucks, so not too expensive. And I definitely see with the retail being at 38 bucks, uh, I think this one's honestly will probably resell probably like, I think like 60 to 80, like $85. That's probably my guest. Um, or not not guest, but guess. Um, and you know, you go for anyone to be honest. Like I think it's all they're all good. But yeah, you know, I'm not necessarily like a beanie guy, but you know, I like I think people are gonna like you know just kind of like how they put the like logo design basically just on like the front side of the beanie. And you know how it'll fit. That's that's you know I think that's why people will like it. So you can definitely resell this one, uh, no doubt in my mind. This is definitely one you could profit on. And uh, honestly, if I had to choose like the order of colorways, I'd say uh, but, like that'd be best. I'd probably just go black, orange, and then the forest green one. But you could go for any one. Those are kind of like. These are like the top six. I mean, they, I, they're they honestly like always accurate, to be honest, like, but like you could put it in this order. My order again was this one, this one, this one, and then, you know, the rest of the ones here. But yeah, you know, you got you got these ones down here also. You could focus on some of these ones. I mean, there's like this one too. This is like a good item you can go for. Uh, it's like a one you could hold every time. The S logo hats always do good. And the down jacket too. Uh, this is also one you could go for. Even this portrait tee, like these, this will probably have some low key resale in this one. If you held, like hold, held it for like a really long time, it'll probably resell too. So any ones you want to go for, uh, you can. And honestly, I'm just, I'm thinking these are the main ones you want to focus on, these top six up here. So that's really the best resale items I got for this week, uh, for this Supreme Week 4 drop. Kind of discussed each one, retails, resell, all that. So I hope you guys did enjoy and let's roll the outro right now. Anyways, I hope you all did enjoy this video. Again, if I will, I'll do these every week. I got, I've been I've been doing them because again, I guess people wanted me to, to discuss Supreme stuff, so you know I'm doing it, and why not? I don't have no problem with it. Uh, then you know I'll definitely discuss resale and stuff like that because I love discussing you know the resale market and all that. Um, you know, you know it's it's like doing decent right now. It's mainly it's mainly with shoes. That's why I've been discussing a lot of shoes and how to cop them. So if y'all want to go check those videos out, feel free. Um, I've been doing a lot of those recently, and you know those are some drops coming up. You can make some money on. Um, but yeah, if you know, again, as I said, if you want to subscribe, you can, I'm pretty sure I already said that. And you can also drop a like on this video, shiny like 200 likes, that'd be dope. And if you also want to, aside from uh, both those things I just pointed out, you can go check my Instagrams too. And, uh, yeah, that'd be great. I'd, I'd appreciate that and all that, you know, that you know, go a long way. Uh, but that's pretty much everything I gotta say. Uh, I got some schoolwork and stuff I gotta do later, so you know, I'm just probably gonna edit this video and then work on that. Uh, you know, cause that's basically what I've been doing. <laughs> you know, making videos and doing school for the last, like, you know, a few weeks. I, I don't have a problem with it, you know, we're chilling. But, uh, yeah, that's pretty much everything I gotta say. So, thank God for watching. And I'm gonna see y'all in the next video. Peace.